Hey guys, I'm back with another video and this is my first DIY on my channel. Um, I've seen these uh, pant shorts on uh, Instagram and I decided to um, create them, well recreate them because I like them. So let's jump right into the video. You're going to need um, some scissors, um, a glue gun and some glue. You're going to need one of these um, little feather thingies. I really don't know what they're what's the correct name for them but I see them in Michaels and a lot of craft stores so you can get them there I got mine on Amazon and you'll also need an old pair of jeans well my jeans aren't that old because I rarely wear them but anyway that's besides the point let's jump right into the video um you're gonna need to cut them because as you can see from the um the little clip they're shorts so you're gonna measure it to you know your length whatever length you want the shorts to be I wanted them like um, really short basically so I just made a little mark on the jeans right there and that was a little too short so I had to move it down a little bit but I made it work okay now you're gonna start cutting just make sure that you're cutting a straight line across it doesn't have to be perfect just make sure it's straight all right, once you're done doing that, you can get rid of the bottom um, part of it because you're not going to use that. You're just going to use the top part. So here's my shorts so far. Now I'm going to take this um, feather thingy that's super cute and I'm going to find the beginning of it and I'm going to measure out the length around each leg of the shorts. And as I measure that, I'm just holding it into place in certain areas so that I get an exact, well not exact, but pretty close measurement. And I'm also going to um, add like an inch or two more to that as well, just to be on the safe side. Alright, I'm going to cut that and yeah, I'm cutting that off. And the extra part, we're going to set it to the side. That's going to be for the other um, the other leg of the shorts. Well, not leg, but leg opening, I guess you can call it. Anyway, now we're going to use our glue gun. So our gun is hot, the glue is hot, and we're placing the glue right on the lower, um, like the lower edge of the, the pants, well, the shorts. And just make sure you put enough glue so that when you do lay the feathers down, they actually stick. So here I'm just making sure it's sticking onto the glue and everything is in place. Now, I mean, now when gluing the um, feather around the, um, the opening of the pants, just make sure that it... Um, the material of the like the denim material of the shorts it's actually laying flat and it's not like um bubbled kind of on top of each other well not really bubbled but folded kind of on top of each other because that's going to make the opening of your pants a little um tighter and it's not going to actually fit when you try to um put it on so just make sure that you're laying the feathers on um the flat material i also wouldn't I um I glued the feather all the way around the leg of the pants. Um, I don't suggest it because it does tighten it up a little bit. You can always leave like the crotch area kind of open if you want to. I mean, if you want to put the feathers all the way around, you can. But here I'm just going around the areas and I'm laying down the feathers. And I'm also, um, like I said, I'm gluing the, the feathers on around the crotch area as well. But it's cool. It still fit. It, even though the leg part was kind of a little snug, but it still fit. I was just letting you guys know so that, you know, you don't make the same mistake I did. Because this was my first time doing this. And I'm just finishing up the, the first leg opening with the feathers. 
and I'm making sure that everything is stuck on tightly so when I do wear this outside it doesn't fall apart you can also use um, fabric glue instead of the glue gun but um, I don't have a specific fabric glue that I would recommend a glue gun is really good so that's why I used it and it's pretty inexpensive I got mine on Amazon for about seven bucks or less and they also um, sent some free sticks for me as well some free glue sticks so now I'm just cutting off the extra um, the excess of the feathers and this one leg is finito add in a little more glue just to secure everything in place and just um I'll trim off the top part of the um the feather thingy. And that's pretty much it. And that's one leg done. And I'm just showing you guys the opening of it and how it looks. Now we're going to move on to the other side and we're going to do the same thing we did on the first leg opening on the other side. I've already measured um, measured the feathers, the length of feather I'm going to use for this side. So I just skip, part, skip past that part and we're just going to jump right into gluing the feathers onto the, the pants of itself. Well, the shorts. I keep saying pants. Well, it is pants, but it's shorts. So... The shorts. And I'm just going to go around the, um, the opening of the shorts with the glue gun and the feathers and just keep gluing and pressing, making sure that everything is laying flat and there's no lumps and bumps in the, um, in the placement of the feathers onto the, dent onto the material. And just make sure you use enough glue because you don't want to use a little insy bit of glue and then it doesn't stick, you know. Use enough glue that is going to stick on there and it's not going to go anywhere, okay? Alright, we're pretty much done at this point. Just doing the last, um, the last glue down, you could say. <laughs> and making sure everything is secured and it's done correctly and I'm just like stretching out the shorts so I know that everything is laying flat now we have this little area left I'm gonna take some more glue place it right there and then stick that feather onto it And I'm just going to snip off the excess just like I did on the last, um, on the previous side. Once I do that, I'm also going to, um, there was a part, yeah, the front part of the feather thingy with the tag was hanging. So I decided to cut that off as well. So here I'm doing that. And once that's off, that's pretty much it for the, the shorts. And you're just going to shake out any loose feathers that's just hanging in there. Clean off my surface. And this is the shorts, guys. I was so excited when when I got to this part. And it was all like I was finished and I'm going to try on my finished product. I was super excited. And this is the leg openings on each side. Like I said, you really don't have to uh, be anal about the, like the edges of the pants because it really doesn't show the edges that you cut. But um, let's go try it on and see how it looks. Okay, so this is the finished look of the shorts. And I am super excited. I can't wait to wear this outside. I definitely want to make some for my nieces so that they can be fly too, just like auntie, okay? But, um, yeah, if you guys did uh, do recreate this or try it out on your own, maybe try it for your daughters, your nieces, or whomever, your cousins, sisters, 
um let me know tag me in it i would definitely love to see it and i did get this idea from instagram i don't know whose original idea this was but again thank you guys for watching the video and i'll see you in my next one bye